Hi everyone, I'm Kinsey and I'm in 7th grade and I'm from Konkometo Secondary School, Paro Bhutan. So today I would like to share something about the forms of government. Before I start, let us understand what is a government. Government is like any other organization where a group of people looks after and manages the work of the state. This group of people works according to the constitution and the other laws. By the way, constitution is the mother of all laws in the country. Like a family manages its day-to-day -day work at home, government also manages the political, social, and economic affairs of the country. Government is of two types, democratic government and non-democratic government. Democratic government. Democracy is a Greek word. Demo means people and kados means power. So democracy means power of the people. The 16th president of USA said that democracy is a government of the people, by the people and of the people. Democracy is also of two types. First one, direct democracy. This is a system of government in which all the citizens take part in the activity of the government directly without representative. People participate directly in decision making or making laws. Such system existed in ancient Greece and does not exist anymore now because it is not popular and difficult to involve all the citizens in the activity of the government. Number two, indirect democracy. This is a system of government in which the citizens choose or elect their representative. Any Bhutanese above age 18 have right to vote in Bhutan. The elected representative run the government. They have to keep in mind the interests of the people and are also answerable to the people. The representative represent political party and the political parties take part in elections. The political party which wins the majority vote form the government and the losing party is called opposition. Indirect democracy is also of two types. Number one, presidential form of government. Under this form of government, President is the head of the government as well as the head of the state. Example, USA where the president and the ministers are not involved in framing the laws. The laws in USA are framed by the members of Congress, which consist of Senate, Upper House, and the House of Representatives, Lower House. Upper House in Bhutan is the National Council and known as Gelyong Togdi. And the Lower House is the National Assembly and known as Gelyong Togdu. Number two, parliamentary form of government. Under this form of government, Prime Minister is the head of the government and the king or the president is the head of the state. Non democratic government. So this government is also called as dictatorship. Under this type of government, people have no right on how the government is run. Such kind of government are very less in the world. Example, North Korea. Thank you so much for listening to me and have a nice day. Bye.